Hey guys, so this is the tag video, and it's the plus size tag, um, or the big girl tag, whatever you want to call it. So, I saw this video last night on one of my subscribers, and I'm also subscribed to her. Um, Glitter Odyssey. Um, if I remember, I hope I remember because I will about bad, really bad that I just said that if I don't remember. I remember, if I remember, I will post the link to her video in the description bar, but I'm really bad about remembering putting links, um, because I like to edit it, get it up, and go. Um, but yeah, if I remember, I'll definitely put that down there. Um, but her YouTube channel is Glitter Odyssey, so if you want to watch her video of this, then you can do that. Um, but yeah, I totally stole this from her, and because I saw her video last night, and I was like, I really want to do that because I feel like I have a lot to say about that kind of stuff. So, it's called the plus size tag, so, um, stay tuned and I'll answer the questions. Okay, so, question one is, what do you classify, classify yourself as? Examples are, um, curvy, fat, thick, plus size, heavy, ample, and then PHAT fat. Um... I classify myself as fat, obviously, um, and I feel like they're all kind of the same thing, but, well, they all are the same thing, but, like, I feel like people use the words differently for each person, if you get what I'm saying, like, if you just say you're, um, curvy, it's like, you're, like, size 14, and then, like, if you're thick, you're, like, size 16, and the plus size is, like, um, 18 on up, and then heavy is, like, like, a general word, and then, honestly, I have no idea what ample means, and then PHAT is just something that I think you use for fun, I guess, um, but yeah, I definitely classify myself as fat, um, yeah. So, question two is, what is your body shape? Example, hourglass, spoon, rectangle, triangle, pear, apple, carries most of her weight in her belly, small hips, relatively large waist, pear, carries most of her weight in her hips, thighs, and buttocks, generally smaller upper body triangle. Okay, so I'm not going to read all examples. Um, mine is, I have no idea what my body shape is, like, Every time, like, I take, like, a little quiz online or something, like, um, to find out what fashion is you or something like that, it's always, like, hourglass, apple, pear, and something else, and I'm, like, I have no idea what to click. Um, I'm actually kind of, like, oddly shaped is if, well, not really, but then, like, to myself I am, like, compared to the people, um that I've seen, like, I'm kind of weirdly shaped. Like, my legs are not, like, they don't match with my body at all. Like, my legs are smaller, and, like, um, like, I have, like, regular ankles, I guess you would say, and, like, my feet are, like, kind of, like, normal feet. They're not, like, fat or anything. And, um, yeah, so... Mine is obvious, it's probably carries most of her weight in her belly, which I do. Like, I have, like, no boobs. And, um, I mean, my arms, like, like up here are kind of big. And then my stomach is just big. Um, that's why I call myself fat. And then, like, my thighs are all, are, like, I would say my thighs are thick. But then, like, past my knees, they're, like, normal legs, which is crazy. I wish, you know, whatever. Are you comfortable? Question three is, are you comfortable slash happy at your current size? Um, honestly, no. But, I mean, you have to, like, learn to be comfortable and happy about it because it's going to take a lot of work and, like, time to, like, lose the weight and stuff like that. Which, I honestly, I've tried so many times and it's so hard because I am a teenager and like I'm going to like I'm not gonna like okay 
You know, like, you go out to dinner with your friends or something, and your friends are, like, ordering this and that, and you're like, well, I'm not going to sit here and eat a salad. Like, like I want to, like, enjoy my dinner with my friends. And, yeah, and so I, I'm, like, I'm not comfortable nor happy, but I'm not, like, to the point where I, like, absolutely hate myself, but... Yeah, and my positive as a plus size person is, um, hmm, that's really hard. I guess, like, I don't know, like, I, this is kind of weird, but maybe it's just me, but not the fact that I'm, like, a plus size or whatever, um, but... I feel like I, like, know what people go through, and I like to give people advice about things, um, and they kind of listen to me because they, they're like, yeah, Andrew's been through that, and stuff like that, but that really doesn't have anything about being plus size, but that's just my positive. <laughs> um, would you like to lose weight, and if so, how much? Um, I don't really know how much. But if I was to lose, like, any weight, like, not saying, like, 1 or 2 pounds or, like, even 10 or 15, like, maybe, like, 50 or, like, 70 or 100 even, like, I would be, like, so happy to lose that much weight. But it's so hard. And, um, yeah. So what is your negative as a plus size person? My I have, like, a lot of negatives. Negatives. Um, I... When I go to stores besides Torrid and, like, stores made for plus-size people, um, like, Forever 21 does have a plus-size section, but it's, like, this little 4x4 four four box in the corner, and I'm, like, really? And, like, most of the time, all they have at my Forever 21 is winter clothes, um, like, clothes that you, like, a plus-size girl would not wear because it is way too hot for that kind of stuff. Which, that, like, makes me so mad. And then, um, another negative is, like, how I get, like, if I'm going to meet somebody for the first time and they don't really know, like, that I'm fat, but they've only seen, like, this much, then I'm like, well, there's no use to me meeting that person because, like, they're not going to like the rest of me, you know? <sighs> but, I mean, I can go on and on about negatives, like, the clothing, and not every, like, this is, like, not every big girl, like, if there's anybody out there that's listening to me, and they, like, have a clothing store, they know people that own clothing stores, not every big girl has boobs that are, like, D's and E's and stuff. I'm barely a B and like it's so hard to find a bra that's like a B and then like a round is like a bigger size. So yeah, that's a negative too. Um what is a fat thing that you do that you think is funny? Like example, breathe heavily or sweat. Um, I don't think sweating is funny, like, that's stupid. And breathing heavily, like, I mean, I don't really do things to breathe heavily. Um, what's funny about being, what is a fat thing that you do that and think is funny? What does that even mean? What, that is, like, a stupid question. What is a fat thing that I think is funny? Um... I don't know, I kind of just joke around about being, like, about fat when we're having conversations with my mom or something, like, and I'll laugh about it, but, like, I mean, if I'm joking around about it, I guess I don't really care, but, yeah, I don't know if that made any sense. What's a plus size pet peeve? Well, the plus size pet peeves are, um, how, how, I, Oh, sorry. I'm totally copying Glitter Odyssey on this question. The answer, the answer, kinda. Uh, 
how you walk in a room and automatically people think that girl's fat because she's lazy and she eats too much or all she eats is cake and stuff like that. That is not true about most of the plus size girls. Um, either they have been through so much and they rely on the food or they have a problem like with their thyroids or something like that or um, runs in the family or it just happened like you don't know like I hate when people judge people especially plus size girls but judging people all together is really bad but everyone does it but judging a fat girl saying oh she's fat because she's lazy and won't get up and walk um no that is not true where it's because of a whole nother other it's because of a whole other reason that you have no idea about. Like, that's what drives me crazy. I hate when people judge people. And yes, I do judge people too, but judge people as in, how do I say this word? Judge people like, as like, the fat, that fat girl is this, this, is this, or like, that black person is this, or that Mexican. Like, I hate when people judge, like, groups of people. But of course, someone's if someone walks in the room, you're gonna be like, "Oh my God, look at her hair, or look at her shoes, or something." Like everyone does that. You can't say you don't do that because everyone does. Um, a plus size tip is um, just be yourself, and even though you are going to like have that insecurity about yourself because of the way you look um you'll overcome it and I'm kind of overcoming overcame it um but not completely because of the big the big reason is high school um yeah and if you're a high school girl and you're watching this video or you're gonna go in high school this year or in a few years or something and you're a plus size girl or any girl for that matter it is going to be hard like, because in high school, everyone is, like, so judgmental. Like, it's the most judgmental place you will ever be in your life. I, when I was in high school, well, I still am in a high school, but my freshman year, I was like, oh, my God. Like, you would think people would grow up. No, they don't. Um... I'm not a senior yet, so maybe when you turn, when you're a senior, they grow up, but I'm going to be in the 11th grade, and um, so far, they haven't grown up, um, which I think is ridiculous. Like, you're in high school, you need to act like you're in high school. But anyways, I don't mean to drag this video out so long, but this is, I, when I saw this tag, I was like, oh my god, I cannot wait till it gets early in the morning, so I can put my makeup on and do this video, because I love this video. Like, oh, sorry. I love um, this tag video because no one ever has a tag for plus size girls or any kind of certain videos for plus size girls. But, um, yeah, I talked for like 12 minutes. But if you guys want to know anything else about this subject or high school for being a girl or a plus size girl or a guy, whatever, um, just let me know, and if you have, like, any questions, I'm still going to do the question and answer thing, um, so if you guys have any questions about anything in my life, or about any makeup or hair stuff, let me know, and I'll be happy to answer any questions that you guys have, um, because I want to do a whole question and answer video. You can, like, put the questions below, or inbox, or whatever, um, so yeah, please go check out Glitter Odyssey's video, um, about the, about the plus size tag and um, tell her that I sent you and I'm sure she's gonna watch this so hey girl um, yeah so you, oh 